Hi, and welcome to my honest and consolidated review for this product. Now, I've gathered lots of reviews from all over, the good, the bad, and the most helpful, then summarized them all into one time-saving video. I recommend watching all the way to the end to decide if this product is a must-have for you. Ready? Let's go! In this video, I will be discussing the Bose Smart Soundbar 600 Dolby Atmos with Alexa built-in, Bluetooth connectivity. The Bose Smart Soundbar 600 is a feature-packed soundbar that requires a bit of tech savviness to set up and use. While it comes with a simple remote control, most features are only accessible through the app. The sound quality for voices was not good initially, but once the dialogue mode was turned on in the app, it became clear. The soundbar can be used with the TV remote, Bose remote, or Alexa voice control to change the volume, but it does not work with TiVo. Alexa voice control can only control the volume and TV input, not the channels. It is voice control enabled, and Amazon Alexa or Google Home can be used to change channels, volume, and input. However, it may have a high listening sensitivity, so the Bose responds even if the command is given from the other end of the house. There is a yellow light on the soundbar that flashes when there is a notification from Alexa. The light can be distracting in dim light or darkness, but it also functions as the volume up and down recognition. The app has many features like adjusting channel bass, treble, syncing with other compatible Bluetooth speakers, and powering on and off. The sound quality is excellent, and there is no distortion at any volume level. The app has a common questions tab that directs users to how to, troubleshooting, downloads, repair, accessories, and community section and a technical spec tab that displays the Wi-Fi, internet name, serial number, and other details. In summary, the Bose Smart Soundbar 600 is a highly recommended soundbar with excellent sound quality and features. Thank you for watching and I hope this video was helpful.